DMT here and today I am doing a unbox not unboxing but showing you guys all my collection of trainers from you know Knights and uh, got a pair of Jordans here. So I want to show you guys all these trainers I've got. Now if you watched my American video you would have seen Gooch showing off all of his collection. The Oreos, the zebras. Oh, wait, hang on a minute, hang on, is this what Nade Shot was showing on? Yeah. Here we go. Oh it's straight fire. So I thought, uh, let me just show you guys what I've got. Now I'm gonna leave this bad boy till last. So we're gonna start off with, uh, I don't know, we'll just go for a random box. This one right here, we're just gonna go with these. And these are the red Air Max ones. They are the red and white Air Maxes. Now these trainers I've had for a while, I've probably had these, uh, I got these in 2014 I think, something like that, I've had them for a while and they still look pristine because I look after my trainers very well. I got them for, I think I got these for around about 100, so 100 pounds they cost me, so yeah, they've lasted quite a while. When I, when I spend 100 pound or more, I try and keep them really nice and tidy because obviously it's a lot of money, so that's one box down. Put it over here, out of the way. Bring all these out of the way. Now, this, as you can see, this box is absolutely battered. It's, yeah, so, as you can tell, the box is ruined. So, I've had these pair for a long time. This pair right here is the black and white flights. I've had these since 2010. Uh, so, they've, I've had them for a good amount of years, seven years, something like that. 2017, I've had these for, yeah, about these for seven years, damn. It's a long ass time. And they still look pretty nice. I mean, some of the white's worn off, as you can see there. Some of the white's kind of worn off, but it, they still look pretty damn good. You know, the material is still intact. It's not dirty that much, really. I've had these for seven years, and they still look hella good. Right, going on to this next box. Bam, these ones, uh, one of my favorite pairs, they are the Air Max 190s. As you can see, it's got that nice suede effect. It is the Timberland look, so they look like Timberlands. Very nice material. Uh, these are brand new. I've only had these for a couple of months. Uh, yeah, so they look spectacular. City. You know what I'm on, baby. Invigo. These are the Invigas. Um, yeah, these cost me 60, I think. They weren't, they weren't that expensive. Uh, they are, I, these are like my gym shoes. I use these for the gym or whatever. Um, yeah, they, they're quite nice. I do like the material on them. They remind me of the Air Max uh, 95s. It's very similar design to the Air Max 95s. Um, so yeah, they didn't cost much. They were pretty cheap for what they are. They look very nice, very, very, very tidy. These, these, I had these um, last. I got these last year. This is when I got these, but these are very beat down. I took them on holiday with me to Iron Apple, took them quad biking, and they're ditched, and I've not bothered to clean them since. So they're, they're very, very uh, beat up. These are the Rochers, the blue Rochers. Uh, so these are very, very beat up at the moment, but they were nice when I did have them. Uh, so yeah, I don't want to show these off too much. <laughs> they're probably like the worst pair I've got. Um, they cost me 80, around about 80, so not bad, not bad. Air Max One Ultra, that's what they're called. Uh, they are very nice. As you can see, it's got the very nice splatter effect on the side. Navy blue, through and out. Very nice. They look, I don't know, a bit sporty, but you can pull them off. They know I flow like that, just like work the next day. Don't make me go right back and black out like a fuse blown. Keep your shoes on, Nike dunks, I'm jumping over your tombstone. So you dare wrong. Iniquities never hinder me, turning my chakra into energy. Then release it on the world for a minute. It might be a dream, but I'm in it. Oh, 
gonna leave this bad boy till last. We've got the Jordans. Uh, in this box is absolutely fuck all because uh, the trainers are over here. Let me just go get them. Air Max ones, I believe, or just Air Max, I can't remember. Uh, these are ones I wear quite often. I've had these since uh, 2015. Yeah, yeah, I've worn them quite a lot. They're a bit dirty, but yeah, they're very, very nice. Grey and white and red. Last but not least, come to the Buddy Jordans right here. They're very nice. They're not one of the new pair of Jordans. They are quite old-ish, but that's, they're still very, very um, classic. They're a classic pair of Jordans. They're very popular. A lot of people have these. Um, they are indeed the Jordan Retro 6s. The red and white retros. Yes, I've had these for a while, not too long, maybe a year or two. Um, I've worn them probably max like three times. I've not worn them that much because I don't want to ruin them. I've had all these pairs for a while. Um, I try and look after them as much as possible and I like to stay with the brand Nike because Nike is one of the best, I think, uh, for trainers. I, I, I don't know, I just like the designs. They're very comfortable and very popular. So, you know, I like to wear Nike, stay with Nike. Most of my clothes are Nike and uh, Nike wear, as you like to call it. That's an American term, I think, Nike instead of Nike. We like to call it Nike down here. Um, so that's my collection. So thanks for watching. Holla at your boy. Peace. Oh, 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 oh,